All right, guys, what's up? Welcome to the channel. I was strolling Lowe's the other day, and what did I see? These. I'm gonna guess the Bosch bits. Mul yeah, we don't even know what they're oh. called. Multi blade hole saw. You guys, this was actually touted at Lowe's as DIY hole saw kit. So I've never seen something like it before, so I decided to go ahead and buy it. Um, actually, it feels very heavy duty, doesn't it? It does, but I don't know if it's just because everything's on there. Yeah. So how it works, guys, I mean, I've never seen anything like this. It's so weird. We have all these blades on here, and then you take these blades off, right, Eric? They twist off, yeah. They twist off. Yep. That's the blade right there. Look at that. How crazy is that? So, so what I'm excited about, Trevor, which is the cool thing, is the plug. I'm so tired of of having something that you get a plug and you can't get it out of there with the screwdriver or just trying to pry it out. This looks like afterwards, that's easy. Wow, so that's all it is you guys, is this piece and then you're gonna slide on whatever hole saw. We're gonna try it live for the first time. We've never used it. Uh, it has a one inch, a one and a quarter, a one and a half, a one and a three a quarter, one and three quarters, two oh, inch, two and a quarter, two and a half. It's good for drywall and PVC and wood, you guys. No sign of metal on the packaging. So let's go. Oh, we even have a Bosch drill here today. Yeah, it's kind of interesting though. Like it's like just lining it up. Just take a look at it. I mean, it lines up and you can get it in there and twist it on, but it does take a little bit. All right, wow. so let's see it drill it home. Eric's team Bosch today. Well, that's the only Bosch battery we have right now. Go ahead, man, give it a shot. Oh, all right, can you hold the wood? All right, you guys, here we go. Wait, something doesn't seem right. Man, it just seems wobbly, doesn't it? Are you sure that's in right? I don't think that's in right. Yeah, I mean, it locked, I think it locked in. Now it is, yeah. It, it like came out, I believe. Okay, ready? Yeah. There's got to be an only way you can rotate this. You probably can't go left. Well, no, just because I think when it's going in there, you know. It's weird. It still feels like it's off. So I'm gonna. I think you know what it is. It's just because it's got that open side. It's got that. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's, yeah. I'm just gonna trust the pilot hole, you guys. So I'm just gonna take it. Through it. So here we go. Like, you know what? It just stops, like, it's not going, it's what it feels like right now. Yeah, I'll do that. Just kind of wobble it a little bit. Wow, so hmm. there's the plug. Is it hot? It's probably hot. Yeah, I don't want to touch it. Um, and we don't have a screwdriver. We have a plastic pen. No, but I think if oh, you have... Go. Wow, that just came oh, out easy. Get out. Wow. Yeah, usually yeah. these are a pain. If anyone's used to the yeah, hole saw. Yeah, so I mean, is. the hole is actually not bad. Which way did you... Okay, so that's what you went in. So that was the finished side of it right there. Huh. Yeah. That's a pretty wild... I've never seen anything like this before. I know. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it does, it's a bit hot, you guys. You might want to be careful. Yeah, but if you got gloves on, I think you can. Yeah. There you go. Let's try a big one. You can do the big one. Um, so, yeah, this just slides on. It's interesting. You definitely want to use this with gloves, only because all these sharp edges and stuff. Oh, is this going to be one finicky of finicky putting yeah, it Yeah, it's definitely finicky putting it together. Okay. You almost got to start on one side and then kind of... Yeah, feed it around. And I wonder if, as time goes on... If it's easier. Yeah, well, no, if heat's going to warp these things. It's it's kind of ingenious. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. It's sort of ingenious, you guys. But see that? That's what freaks me out. Well, it's not on straight. There you go. Now it's on straight. It still looks it still a little looks off, wobbly. but let's see you try it. Give it a shot. You got it? I got it. That drill smoking. Okay, it did it. Wow, so that drill was smoking. So it obviously No, because there's I think there was stuff in there. Oh. But still, I mean that put that put a lot of wear and tear on it. Man, look how easy that plug comes out. I know. That's that, amazing. That put a lot of wear and tear on that drill. 
No, that was oh, one yeah. of the drills that we did. Uh, no, you're right. It doesn't smell like it's burning. No, but that was one of the drills we did a while back with uh, Tool. Um, oh, the Tool fight. Tool fight. Yeah. Um, um, yeah, it wasn't burning up, you guys. It just looked like it. there was just grease or something in there. You saw the, no. It doesn't even feel warm. No. But it did. I no, did. it's because I was in two and I put it in one. But it did, like, put a toll on that drill. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. You sure your battery's charged, though? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> I mean, I'm just saying, compared to a regular bit, is this suck up more power? I don't think it does, because it's a thinner wall. It's a very thin wall compared to whatever. I mean, think about the other ones that are thicker, you know? Right. Wow. I, mean, I just think that's so cool with the well, plug. I've never seen a plug come out that easy. I know. When I ever. first got these, I saw people saying, oh, I've had their, their pain in the ass, da da da. But honestly, from the first two holes we made, I think that it did a good job. Now, granted, if you're a construction guy and you're pull, pulling, plugging holes all day, probably not. No, but I think you said, you. you said this is more graded towards the homeowner. Yeah, it's graded. graded. It's. What, what marketed. Marketed, yeah. You know. it's, mar it's called the DIY hole saw. So I think for the homeowner, for, I think I paid $14 for this with all these, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different hole sizes in there, all set in one kit. I think it's a home run. I do too, because you know, I mean, how much these cost, like if you get a kit, they're expensive, and as a homeowner, how often are you really using them? This is just a nice kit to have, like, hey, I, I'm gonna do something, I need to run something, and boom, this is perfect, I got it. And you're not having 60, 70, $80 sitting in your toolbox that it's not being used. Right, and if you don't hit metal with it, like nails or anything in the wall, they're gonna probably last quite a while if you can mm -hmm. keep them sharp. Man, that is just such a cool idea. Yeah. Like you said, I've never seen. When I first saw it, I was like, wow, this is different, you know? But it was cool. So it's up to you guys. We'll put the link at the bottom, you guys. TV back we got it at uh, actually Lowe's. This TV thing's getting old. That's just so cool. So we saw it. We'll check it out, you guys. Check it out at Lowe's. Uh, we'll put the link below where you guys can check it out. I mean, it's crazy. You know, Bosch isn't really known for DIY stuff, but. Hey, this is cool. That's just such cool. I still just can't get over it. I mean, I honestly, the plug out. dude, I got this. I, I bought this the other day. Just, you know, I was like, this is cool. But now you seeing it, if you see it, are you going to buy it? Oh, yeah, I definitely would. Yeah. Because right now I've been using, um, I think it was Diablos, because I'm running pipe all through the house and all that. So I'm running copper and I'm running waste for PVC stuff. So, and I've been using these, not this one, but I've been using another kit. And it's just, you drill one hole. Like, I've got two, long story short, it's just a pain in the butt to get the plugs out. No matter how easy they always say it is this to do. You never can find the screwdriver. Like, where did I put it last time to get the plug out? You can't find it, you know. So. Right, but you're not going to be using crazy production with this. No, but I'm just saying, I like how, I, I cannot believe how easy it is to get the plug out. And to me, right there, 14 bucks, best money I've ever spent. Even wow. though I don't spend the money. You heard it, dude, from Enrique. You know? He's he's working on the world's longest house project. I am, I man. Am. I am, now, Someone dude. asked me the other day, they're like, how's Eric's pro house going? And I'm like, oh, I, I think this month they're working on gutters. It was yeah. Funny. It was well, what's funny, though, is how long should it take? Well, I don't know, Eric, because yeah, I'm not a contractor. That's what I, mean. I don't <laughs> know. People say it's taking a long time, but it's like, dude, I'm doing a job. I'm coaching two babies. I'm not even getting into it, but yeah. I don't know. I'm excited it's about still, it. It doesn't matter. It's a cool test bed for things. For it's tools. an awesome test so bed. So the longer you know? it goes on, the better because we have content. Tell my, please tell my wife that. Yes, because the minute we're doing, I know. Yeah, hey, Tara, the minute you guys get a kitchen, it's all over, okay? <laughs> Let's stay without <laughs> that kitchen for another six years yeah. so we have content. Oh my God, I got it. So now I'm starting electric, so I'm doing electric. And I'm debating or not whether to run all the pipe myself or have someone come in there and do it in two days and just be done with it. Oh, man. I'd rather just do it myself and run everything. And then have someone come in and do all the wiring and everything. But That's a good March project. No, that'd be March. That'd be January. March, March to April, March. April, May, March June, to July. March. Yeah, March yeah. to March. You guys, it's going to be crazy. Peace out, you guys. Let us know what you guys think. Comment below. Obviously, some of you guys are going to come in right away ripping on it. It's not designed to be the latest and greatest best out there. Price points, DIY, it's awesome for that. Even if you got one or two holes out of it, you know what I'm saying? And it lasted. I mean, honestly.
I, yeah. Again, least, man, I'm just amazed. The one thing I think is a little finicky is you're going to try to put them on, but if you're homeowner, you're not in a rush, you're not doing a production, big deal. You can take a little bit more time and put it on. I just absolutely love how easy it is. I've never seen anything with the plug coming out that quick, and that's what I just love. Yeah. But, I mean, like I said, you know, you got to make those two holes. I mean, you're going to spend $14 on just one two-and-a-half inch. You know? You're right. Yeah, you know yeah. what? You're right. Exactly. Now, even yeah. let's say we burn out the two-and-a-half, we still have all these others. Mm-hmm. So, especially PVC. I feel like this stuff would rip through PVC. Do we have, we don't have PVC don't here. Have PVC. You know what we can do? What? Go over to theirs and just rip through their plumbing. Oh my God, how funny would it be? Just walk just into the shop, there, dude, right into the first PVC pipe in the wall, and just be like, Shh, <laughs> no, whatever no it is in Spanish, C? Is it C? No, what's no? No hablo English. Huh? No hablo English. No hablo English? Yeah, I think that's what it is. No, no I'm just... I don't know. <laughs> Peace out, you guys. Comment below, go to Lowe's, check it out. <laughs> Peace. Remember, for more exciting tool action, Go to toolsinaction.com.